Country Director of Future World Design Limited, Mr. Benabo, has stated that there are serious questions over the structural design of the five-story central administration building at the university campus. Future World Design Limited is the project manager of the building construction. As per their contract signed with the university on the 9th of November 2022, the company was responsible for quality outcome of the building and to ensure all designs were made to required engineering standards. However, the company got terminated in 2023. Mr. Benabo revealed the events leading to their termination of contract. In the process, we know that the uh, structural design uh, of the building was done to seismic code 3 requirement. We consider that that was not correct and recommended that uh, work be stopped and the design raised to seismic code 2. Benabo stated that although they have requested for arbitration, UOG refused. The matter was then taken to court and the court has ordered that the company will go to arbitration and sought these two important matters. Uh, we are in arbitration um, and uh, there are two, two issues. One very important one is the safety of the building where we recommended that the structural designs be upgraded from code 3 to code 2. Um, that issue will have to be deliberated at um, arbitration and uh, the other issue, related issue, is our termination. Lawyer representing Future World Design Limited, Christopher Jaminan, stated this. When we compromise quality, we end up compromising so much of our future. And so the simplest thing to do is do what is right. And doing what is right simply requires us to sit down, have a face-to-face -face conversation, find a solution on going forward. Attempts made to get a statement from the Minister for Higher Education, Research, Science and Technology, Don Polier, were unsuccessful. Grace Papiali, National MTV News.